So in this question, we are given a geometric series and we are asked to determine whether it converges or diverges. Now a geometric series begins with a number, in this case three, and then to generate the next number, which in this case is negative four, we multiply by a constant that we just label r. The r stands for common ratio. So three multiplied by r would give us negative four. And then similarly, negative four multiplied by that same common ratio r would give us positive 16 thirds, and so on. We would take 16 thirds and multiply it again by the common ratio r, and that would give us negative 64 ninths, and we would keep doing this infinitely many times. And the question is, well, if we did this infin infinitely many times and added them all together, would we get a finite result or would we get an infinite result? So in order to understand whether it's gonna come out to be a finite result or an infinite result, we look at this statement right here. So the series will definitely be convergent if the absolute value of our common ratio, r, is less than one. So all we have to do is check to see if the absolute value of the common ratio is less than one. And so of course we need to figure out what the common ratio is. And you can do this in any number of ways, but if we take the first term, which was three, and multiply it by the common ratio, which is r, we should get negative four. And so all we need to do is solve this little equation for r, and to do that, of course, we'll just divide both sides by three. And we can see that the common ratio r is negative four thirds. Now, we didn't have to do this with three and negative four, they just happen to be the easiest values. As an exercise, you could check to make sure the common ratio is constant by in fact, starting with negative four and multiplying again by the common ratio of r, and that would give you positive 16 thirds. Let's solve this for r and see if we get the same result. We can divide both sides by negative four. So now we would have r is equal, okay, so here you're gonna do a little keep change flip. You'll keep the 16 thirds, you'll change the division here to multiplication, and then you will reciprocate the negative four. So you'll have one over negative four. If we multiply this out, we get 16 over negative 12. And if we reduce that, we still get negative four thirds. So that's just another way you could confirm that the common ratio is negative four thirds. So now that we know the common ratio is definitely negative four thirds, we can test for convergence by applying this rule right here. So now we just tape, take the absolute value of negative four thirds, which of course is positive four thirds, and ask ourselves, is that less than one? And in fact, it is not less than one, it's actually greater than one. Therefore, this geometric series is divergent, or you could say it diverges. And that's it, that's all you have to do to determine whether or not that series converges.